I'm at Kaloa Landing. It's pretty early. So right now I'm here alone. That's gonna change soon because this is one of Kauai's busiest dive sites. It's the only shore dive location that's really truly a viable spot on the South Shore. There are other places that you can dive, but there's some kind of a problem with every other spot. Too shallow, long surface swim, not really much to see, really small. This place though is really fun. There's so much to see here, very, very rich site. In just a couple of minutes, a parade of vans and trucks is gonna start rolling down the hill. All the dive operators coming here to get set up for the morning's tours. Today we're in what we normally think of as one of the slowest times of the year. So it's probably not gonna to get too busy down here, but during peak season, summer, holidays during the winter, Christmas, Thanksgiving, that time of year, there might be 50 to 80 people down here, all trying to get into the water and see the fun stuff like turtles, eels, all the tropical fish, and plenty of healthy corals that you can find at this spot. From the early 1800s and into the 1900s, Kaloa Landing was a very important harbor. During the days of whale hunting, ships would come here seeking provisions. Then later, during the era of large sugar plantations, this place was very busy with up to 60 large ships per year stopping here to anchor in the bay. Today, most of the evidence of his past has gone from view. Some indicators do persist though. If you have sharp eyes, then underwater, you can find several lengths of large chain, a huge broken anchor, and an old engine block. However, none of this stuff is what people come here to see. Instead, it's the marine life. The underwater world here is full of beauty. Don't take my word for it though. Come along and see for yourself. This video was sponsored by Garden Isle Divers, your best choice for exploring Kauai's underwater world.